Welcome back everybody. This is Thomas Bartram with Homesteading Bartram Style. Today it's uh, actually day 12 on the candling. Um, uh, gonna get into this and see what we can find. Uh, gonna test and see what we come up with here. Hopefully we find lots of uh, well-developing uh, embryos in these eggs and I'm gonna bring you along with me. So let's get started. All right, so what I've done is I've uh, separated out the ones that look like they have, at this point in time, gone ahead and perished. This time of year, you never know with it being cold outside and whatnot when the eggs are being laid by the chickens. And that causes some of the issues that you come across. So basically, uh, it looks like I've got uh, about 10 that may have perished. So I'm gonna give you a, a few close-up examples of the really cool ones that we can see real good. Now in this one, you can see the veins and right there's the, the baby in there moving around. And there's some more veins. So that's one. This one, again, shows, get you in the view here, right? Ah, there we go. See some of the veining there up in this area? Really nice veining. Now these are brown eggs, as you know, so they don't show real good. Now this one, again, right there, we see the veining from the top, right there and over here. And if you turn it that way, you see nothing but a moving around uh, baby in the bottom. See it moving? So they're uh, coming along. Now this one is guaranteed to please. Look at those veins. How beautiful. See the baby in there moving? If I move the light, sometimes when you move the light, they'll move. But you can see beautiful veining. So, definite development. Now this egg is a classic example of the death ring. Now you can see it real clear. On those first ones that I took out before, you couldn't really see it, but on this one you can see it as clear as day, the red ring of death. And you can see right there was the baby. It started, but it 
perished early on. Something happened that took it out. And the ones that I know that are definite red ring of death is going to be removed today. The ones where I'm not 100% sure, I'm leaving in till uh, day 18. That's uh, six days from today. And then I'll do one last candling before I lock them down. And from there, uh, we'll uh, wait till day 21 and see what we get. Now, if you enjoyed the, the video today, please uh, consider going ahead and hitting the subscribe button down there. We'll bring content to you like this as often as we can. Uh, it's fun for me to show you what's going on here on the homestead. And hopefully it's fun for you to, to watch and see some of the development on this and some of the other projects that we do here. Uh, if I'm not wrong, I believe uh, there's a, a video going to be released in the next couple of days by my wife. She's going to make a cheese ball that's pretty cool. It's, it's awesome. I love it. So, just a forewarning. Uh, if you're into cooking, she's going to make a good one. So, I will see you all the next time around. Have a great day.